Hi guys, welcome back to this video. It's going to be a video on how to use Skype through the web. It's called the web.skype.com. If you guys do not use your desktop application for Skype and you want something more light, you can always use it through the browser and this is what we're going to be showing you how to do. Now first it's going to ask you to get a web plugin. Go and do that. Add that extension. Once that's added, it may ask you for a desktop call version of this. Press that, get the plugin. And once you do that, save it to your desktop. Also, run it and install it. And once you have that all set, it seems that I can refresh just to make sure that everything is set and ready to go. I'll put this to the side and I'll also bring up the desktop version of Skype. It seems pretty accurate in terms of um, it being familiar. Contacts seem the same. Everything else seems the same. Uh, search Skype contacts right here. You can also search for new people, I believe. If I were to click on my name, this drops down. I can make myself available or unavailable and it syncs the same. Make myself available. I can go to my account and I can also sign out. Okay, so what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to try to call my friend to see if this actually works. Um, I did have to adjust my sound settings and audio settings, also mic settings too, to get this to work. So I'm not really sure how it's going to work perfectly, but hopefully it does. All right, we're connecting to Anton currently right now. And we have a nice little jingle. Um, hey, Anton, what's up? Hello. Can you hear me? Yeah, I can okay. hear you. Perfect. Um, just so you know, I am using Skype on the web. Um, it is um, way different, but also similar to the desktop version. Um, and it seems actually oh, a, lot, okay. a lot lighter. Yeah. So it's pretty cool. Hey, um, would you mind doing me a favor? Uh, try tap typing something in the chat box. I'm going to see something pop up currently. All right. I'll try that. Cool. Cool. All right, so if you you're anything? yeah, if you're in Google Chrome, um, Web Skype shows a notification saying um, Anton, and he just hung up, so that's good enough for me. Um, perfect. All right, so um, that was a little test of how this actually works. So if you guys want something that is a lot lighter and through the web rather than Skype on desktop, this is probably for you guys. So. Um, you guys seen it live and in action, and uh, yeah, we we are definitely, definitely sorted out. Thanks, buddy. Long time friend, right there. All right. So again, if you guys um, want to use this web version opposed to the desktop, please do so. It's called the web.skype.com. Um, I believe it's available in any language. I'm using it on the English version. Yeah, so <laughs> yeah, so if you guys want to give this video a thumbs up, please do so. And I'll also link this website in the info bar below. And if you guys do want to Skype me, I'll actually include my name right here at the very top right here. So you guys can add me as a contact if you guys have any questions in regards to Windows or anything in regards to technology or whatever. Yeah, so that's it for this video. If you guys want to stay tuned, please subscribe and also leave a thumbs up and that's it. See you later guys. Goodbye.